Hey peeps, what is up? It's Alicia. I hope you're doing good. I know it's been a long time since I filmed and sorry for this no makeup look. Uh, and when I say sorry, what I mean is I don't care because I'm not putting it on. Uh, no, but seriously, um, we are actually in the process of moving and it's been really chaotic. Um, and the doll slash makeup room is actually completely empty. There's nothing in it right now. Um, so it's kind of sad, but I got in a bunch of stuff and I was like, you know, I really want to share this with my people because it's some pretty cool stuff. So I actually ordered some stuff off Beauty Bay. You may not have heard of it before. I hadn't really heard of it before and I was looking for something and I found it and they had some really awesome prices. It does come from England, um, but surprisingly it came super fast. It's been like a week and it's already here. Um, we've also got the Margo Elena fall subscription coming up um, very soon. That'll be here. That one almost got put on hold because we were supposedly moving um, on like the 7th of this month, September. It's not even September yet, but it will be very soon. And uh, that fell through. So now our new uh, move-in date is going to be middle of October. So I'm just happy that I was able to still get that Margo Elena subscription. My dog thinks I'm talking to him. So just give you a quick little video of my super adorable dog. Another one of our pets, if you have not met him yet, his name is Benny. He's very proud of himself and he is a mama's boy. Right, Benny? Benny, you wanna go inside now? Okay. You wanna say hi? You wanna say hi? Okay, so I just grabbed the package out of the mailbox. Um, it says it is blah dee dee da. It doesn't say, but it feels like it's less than two pounds. And all I remember ordering is these like limited edition Disney eye pencils, which I'm super excited about. They were on super sale. By the way, with everything I got and a uh, parcel post, it was $40. So that's the box, pretty cute, nice piece of paper, packing slip, let's see, I ordered one, two, three, four, five, six things, and do, 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 one, two, two of them were these loose uh, eyeshadows, which I've never tried before, and I'm so freaking excited because they're literally so pigmented. So this is one of the items, it's from a company called sample beauty and because i'm on my phone it's i'm hoping the film comes out okay but again i apologize i'm gonna do my best let's just open up one of these um and see oh goodness gracious so this is called spice up your life it has a 36 month shelf life after opening and um i am anal retentive so come on Come on, it's not doing it. Okay, uh, I will put the date on when I opened it. So I can actually see it moving around inside. So I'm just gonna, and it's glass too, which is great. So it's glass and it looks like aluminum, which is wonderful for our environment. Easier to recycle. So let me just take off this. Oh, yeah, yes. So I don't know if you can see that, but that's like insane. I'm hating that the camera is focusing on me, but that's fine. And it's got also the re another reason I grabbed this was because it has this like little bit of sparkle to it. Oh my god. Oh, oh my god. Oh lordy. So that's crazy. Crazy beautiful. I'm like so psyched. Okay. And if I remember correctly, this was like ridiculously inexpensive. It was like. I know, I don't know, maybe it was like $3, but it was cr it was crazy inexpensive, okay? So that's one thing. So that's Sample Beauty, and that is color Spice Up Your Life. There's another one, and they put them right on top. Let's go ahead and open this one. Check the time. I have a client coming in 10 minutes. So I just wanted to get this video started, so when I get back, I can play with them a little bit. Oh, no, they gave me two Spice Up... Wait a minute. Why did I order two Spice Up Your Lifes? <sighs> Flippin' heck. 
I don't think I did that on purpose. Well, I better not open that one. I can probably sell it or something. I know I ordered two, so I don't know why I ordered two of those. Oh, well. Okay, maybe I was going to give it to my mom. This one's called Bambi. So this is, again, Sample Beauty, Loose Pigment, 36 months. 36 months after opening sorry my cat just made a noise and this one is orange so let's go ahead and open this one up and you know what's interesting about these pigments is they don't actually seem like they're gonna need a lot of primer oh my word how bright is that like really okay let's put oh, they give you a ton too. Oh my gosh. Wow. Okay, that's really, really pigmented. That's crazy. Crazy good. All right, I'm gonna put this back in. I didn't even know how I was gonna use these. I just had to have them, especially the pink with the glitter because, wow. Okay, I'm making a mess of myself. I was super excited about grabbing a couple of eyeliners um, from them. Ah, I know what happened. I wanted to order two of these Dumbo eyeliners, but instead I accidentally ordered two pigments. Dang it. That's okay. All right, so we got some um, limited edition Disney eyeliners, which I was super excited about. These were definitely less than $4 each, which is awesome. Um, this one's called Dumbo which I was really excited about. And then this one is called Jungle Book, which was also a really pretty color. This one's more like a lilac. Sorry for the camera being wackadoo. Um, so I'm very much feeling like that whole like baby blue eyelid with, um, or white with a wing liner. Like I just love that look for myself. I think it's really classic and pretty. Um, so let's go ahead and open up this Dumbo one. So it's kind of like a color stick. And let's see. Oh, oh my gosh. Wow, the color payoff is awesome. Get out of their face. That's so pretty. I can't wait to try this and put it on. Um, let's try the lilac one. There are two other things in this box besides these two cream eyeliners. These are, I don't remember who these are from. I think these may actually be from Beauty Bay, if I'm not mistaken. Yes, so these are actually Beauty Bay products. So Beauty Bay not only sells exceptional lines, other lines, they sell their own lines. So this one is the Jungle Book Disney Eyeliner, and this has, they both have a six month shelf life after opening, which kind of sucks, but that's okay. Probably because they won't be as creamy. That's gorgeous. I'm just making sure you guys can see if I look like a creep, that's why. Gorgeous. And they're literally so creamy and so soft. I'm so excited, yes. Okay, so when we get back, I have my client. I'm gonna show you another product that I was super excited to try and a limited edition eyeshadow palette that I had to have. There were so many products on Beauty Bay that I wanted and because everything was so fairly priced, it's super high end, it's super pigmented. Like if you like to play and you like colors and fun and new things, this is your home. Like this is where you need to go because their prices are really fair. Like I said, um, the shipping is great. Prices are awesome. I, I don't know, I keep saying that, but it's true. Um, and they don't just have makeup, they have skincare. And like, I don't know about you guys, but I'm so sick of Ulta, I'm so sick of Sephora. Like same old, same old, boring. I want fun, bright, interesting things that I can play with because life is short. So um, when we get back, I will show you the rest of the stuff we got, but there's another quick little, I know I'm being creepy and I'm sorry. Just wanna make sure you guys are seeing that. But that's, look at the sparkle on that. Like, are you kidding me? That's without a primer. Oh my God, I cannot wait to put it on. All right, see you guys soon. Okay, I'm back. So we, saw the pencils which were great and um check out the pictures that i'm gonna post as well because they are very long lasting which i was really happy about um i had put some on my hand washed my hands with soap taken a shower 
Um, I even used like not a cream, but something more emollient and um, it still didn't come off. So very impressed with that. Um, there are a couple other products that I'm really excited to try. So this one, let's take the sticker off so I can actually open it. This is not coming off easily. Uh, this is 18 months once it's opened, which is pretty cool, from a company called Glisten Cosmetics. It is a wet liner, and this is in the color Blueberry. So again, going back to that blue theme that I've been trying to um, get up on. And the cool thing about this company is they literally have so many colors. So it's awesome. And that just looks super pretty, super like, almost like a periwinkle blue. So this is a wet liner. So for this product, you would use, I'm pretty sure, oh wait, maybe you don't need any water to activate it. I thought you did. Cause so I'm just grabbing a little bit with my pinky here. I feel like it would work better obviously with a, uh, a brush and some water. So let me go grab that because there's really not a lot of color payoff that way. So let's go grab that. Okay, I'm back. Uh, I grabbed a sweatshirt because it's 63 outside, which probably isn't cold to some people, but in New England, it's been like 80, 90, 100, and now all of a sudden it's a reasonable temperature because it's September 1st. So of course now it's reasonable. Anyways, I grabbed a brush, an angled brush clean. I grabbed some uh, water. So this is actually a spray, but it's fine. We'll do the same thing. And just make sure it's wet. Now let's put it into the product, which it is grabbing some more. So that's good. Hopefully you can see that without my face in there. Um, let's go ahead and, ooh, oh yeah. Much better, much better, much better. Let me just grab a little bit more here. Oh yeah, this is great. Oh yeah, this is great. And I think this is gonna last. Oh wow, that's pretty. That is pretty. Again, sorry for being a creep. I just wanna make sure you can see that. So excited to try that. Excited to try the pink glitter. Awesome, awesome, awesome. And again, this was not super expensive. I don't, there's no way it was more than six or seven dollars. Maybe a little bit more, but everything I got was super cost effective. Okay. So the very last thing, which I'm super excited to show you, and I hope it's not broken because that would be very upsetting, is if you like Makeup Revolution, which I do a lot because their pigments are actually have a really nice payoff and um, it's just, I just love their stuff. I love that they, they have tin packaging. I think it's really cute. They, they always have limited edition stuff and their prices are really fair. Anyway, so I found this palette and it is it was on sale. Um, so this is the DC Revolution Mad Love Forever Flawless Palette. So if you like DC Comics like I do, I was super excited to grab this one. Um, it's so cute and so pretty. And I think it was like 13 bucks, which you really can't beat that. So let's go ahead and open it, which it has these little tabbies, which is super convenient so you don't have to destroy your nails so let's take the tabbies off when i looked at the palette online i was like oh my gosh that's so cute and i can't believe it's only 13 dollars. that's amazing please don't be broken please don't be broken oh, yes it's so cute you guys uh so this is a suicide squad palette there's a plastic ah there's a plastic layer on the top and obviously like you can't see it as good because it has the plastic so let's just let that fall down right it's on the floor now dang it but look at those colors so pretty i know i'm so creepy i'm sorry and it has that blue again that i'm obsessed with the white that really cute sparkle the red the really intense green i mean I had to have it, especially since it was only 
So we are going to play with a couple of these. I don't know if I want to play with this one. Just kidding. Of course I do. Um, I don't know how I'm going to do my makeup because I wanted one to be like that retro blue with the liner, but I also kind of want to play with this. So, ah, uh, I don't know. I don't, I don't want to make it too complicated. Maybe I'll do like one eye with like the retro and then one with like the fun colors with like the pink glitter. So I played with the sample beauty pigment, which is insane. That's called Bambi. And just so you know, I am super limited on my brushes because literally everything has been packed. So I literally just use my finger to apply my Gerard Cosmetics primer, which I always do first. And then I literally took whatever color, as you can tell, <laughs> from the lid and just popped it on, which is seriously, and this is a natural light. I am obsessed. I'm obsessed. I can't wait to try the pink. Probably won't do that in this video. Um, and then I used the Mad Love Suicide Squad palette, which I love. I love Makeup Revolution too because all their palettes are super versatile. They have glitters, they have shimmers, they have mattes. Some of the colors are sheer, but build buildable. So this is some of the swatch. I should probably flip the camera around. Uh, how do I do that? I don't know. Here we go in natural light. I didn't do all the colors because some of them I felt were pretty straightforward. So I tried to pick a different formula and obviously it's going to look different on everybody, right? I'm super fair. So, um, but yeah, this is not a full look. Clearly I just have brows, liner, mascara, and the eyeshadows. I use some of the green and the matte, like ivory color, the really pretty glitter on the inside corner from the uh, mad love palette so i'm going to wipe this off wish me luck and then i'm going to use the two new disney pencils we got and the uh wet liner as well on the other eye um so yeah so then i'll have more of like a daytime look but just so you guys can get a feel for all the different products that we got from beauty bay hmm. come say hi Okay, so I did the eyeshadow pencils on this side, uh, or the eyeshadow sticks, and I think I may have put just a little bit too much on because it's creasing, but if I go like this, it doesn't really come off, so that's good. And then this side is the wet liner, which I am absolutely obsessed with. Um, it was super easy to work with, and the color is just absolutely gorgeous. Um, you could totally use these together just kidding um put this down first and then put this on so this act both of them actually are with no primer because I wiped off the primer with a makeup wipe um from all those really bright colors that we had on earlier so I'm going for like a three mile walk in a minute so we'll see how this wears um for when I come back and I have a feeling I don't know, this one didn't come off easily uh, yesterday on my hand, but then when I put like hand cream on and washed my hands with soap, it came off. This did not. So I'm kind of curious to see, you know, how it's gonna last when it's actually on my face. Okay, I'm back from my three mile walk. And as you can see, it is kind of uh, creased a little bit, but that's probably also because I have oily eyelids. Um, from far away though, it looks pretty good. Uh, I think, you know, maybe just some primer next time. I think that would actually, uh, fix the issue. So now you can see a little bit more of like the longevity and it's around 80 around here. It's a little cool. So like in terms of like there's a breeze and everything. So that kind of does make a difference as well. All right, peeps. That's the video. That's my unboxing of Beauty Bay. It's my dog and uh, my experience with it. I did end up going into the bathroom again uh, because this was creasing super bad and just like used a Q-tip. This actually looks almost the same um, and my eyeliner, even though it's waterproof, lifted into it. I don't actually know if that's the eyeliner or the mascara. Either way, um, I think they'll both perform better with a primer um, underneath. 
but I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, I'm going to list the products in the description of the video so that you know if there's any products that you are interested in, you can find them. And as always, um, try to be kind. I know it's hard, especially in today's world, but try anyways. Anyways, thanks for watching and I'll see you soon.